We are all so different. Each of us is unique and we compare our differences all the time. We compare ourselves to each other on the basis of a standard of how good at something we're supposed to be or how beautiful or how powerful or rich we're supposed to be in order to feel complete, accomplished, whole. And when you think about it, ultimately, it always comes down to wanting to feel like we belong. We're comparing our differences on a scale of worth, shaming what is not enough or too much, and until we get to that standard, something within us believes that we might not belong. But haven't we forgotten something there? I'm a trained engineer, and one of the very first things we learn in mathematics and physics is that you can't compare two physical quantities that don't have the same nature, that are not measurable in the same measuring unit. You can't say 100 pounds are superior to 3 miles. It just doesn't make sense. It is only because two things are of the same nature that you can compare them. Have we humans lost ourselves in believing we should be more this or less that so that we can belong when belonging, being of the same nature, is precisely what allows us to make such comparisons? What if our differences were actually what was meant to be? What if the thing that you don't have but that a part of you would really like to have was actually meant to not be yours. So that the act of someone giving it to you, or teaching it to you, or showing it to you, could happen. There always is something about you that is different, and that gets to be celebrated in that way and shared with others. We're afraid we'll be cast out or abandoned, so we unconsciously take refuge in comparing ourselves to secure our place in the world. But instead of a threat, what if our separation and what makes each of us uniquely different was actually a wonderfully fun thing to play with and share with each other like a team with different specific roles? Because at the core of it all, our oneness, our belonging, cannot ever cease to be. What if that appreciation for your difference and sharing of it was the only true key to feeling the given sense of belonging underlying it all. You have the power to remember that. No one's superior. No one's inferior. We're all one. So show me, who are you?